Hey, what's up? I'm Nizio Cole, and welcome back to another episode of Game Vault. Game Vault is a series where I play Steam and Epic games that are unplayed in my library, because let's be honest, we have a lot of them. Whether it's Steam sales, free Epic games, or Humble Bundles, sometimes you just have a lot of games that you never end up going through. So in this series, I go through my library of unplayed games, which right now is at about 70, and uh, play them and basically review them. So today we're gonna be talking about a game called Earth X. Now this is what some would call like a clicker or idle game, something sort of like a adventure capitalist or cookie clicker, but this one is space themed and in particular SpaceX themed. Basically it kind of goes through the very beginning of SpaceX and you get to basically just build up this space company and you get to build production sites and launch pads and launch rockets and you have to manage all the finances, you have to get different launch contracts. And I will say, just as a warning, it is extremely addicting. Like this is one of the first games in a while where I had to rip myself away from the computer because it was so addicting. And I believe this game just got its full feature release because I was playing it in early access. So I can imagine it's even more fun than it was before. This is actually a very polished game. It's very fun. I love the art style. It only starts getting a little laggy once you have like a million satellites in orbit and just building a bunch of different facilities. But like I said, I haven't played since the early access, so I don't exactly know if there have been performance upgrades. But this is a very, very fun game. If you like this style of game, I definitely recommend you play it. And there's kind of like a low-key story in the background with different people from the space industry that have kind of different names or slightly different names. As time goes on, there are different news stories as well, like around the same time that those news stories would have happened in real life, which I think is pretty cool. And it's actually got a fair bit of difficulty to it because all your rocket launches, just like in real life, aren't going to go perfect. Sometimes the landing will fail, sometimes the mission will fail altogether. This is definitely a fully fledged, very thought out game. And like I said, it's very, very fun. I can't say that enough. As always, I will have the link to buy this game down in the description if you want to go check it out, as well as the link to the developers. So yeah, I hope you all enjoyed this video, and I'll see you all in the next video. Peace.